How's it going, everybody? Game Guy here, bringing you part six of our City Skylines Let's Play. When we last left off, we worked on our uh, subway system and actually worked quite well. Uh, let's look at it right now. That's actually just traffic. 25, 2,600 people per week. Uh, over 2,600 if you count the tourists, which we don't have any tourism right now. But yeah, guys, it's uh, looking pretty good. We got some death problems and stuff over here. Hang on, before we get started here, we are cranking that bad boy down right to about right there. That's a little bit better. Okay. So where we left off, guys, we were actually uh, building the subway. We were expanding this uh, area, expanding Dumbtown essentially in order to get Dumbtown to um, uh, essentially grow, um, increase land value, and level up. Um, so they pay more taxes because um, their their property's worth more. Um, we do have a big demand for industry. I'm not sure if that is um, res. Uh, re I'm not 100 percent sure if that is offices or um, like our industry down here, which is sawmills and stuff. We've got a lot of abandoned buildings we need to go in and clean up, though. So hopefully we'll get that squared away here in just a minute. How's our properties and stuff looking? Oh, okay, so we bought all this property. We can actually start expanding our downtown if we need to. Um, which I don't think there's a need to. I'm going to I wanna do a test here with this. Go ahead and set that there. We'll go ahead and just do a test right here. With that area, see what it does. Go ahead and 3 exit here. The demand is starting to drop, which is good. Okay. One overworked. Okay, that's fine. On one over educated. Okay, so I think we might need offices. Um, if that's the case, I'm going to have to expand. Yeah, I'm going to expand. So, how's our traffic looking? 80%, which is not bad. Our worst offenders are right here. Um, this port right here. This highway area right here. Which, honestly... We can fix. We can fix that. Just by deleting that right there, we can fix that. Yep, just by deleting that, we fix that problem, probably, more than likely. Because um, what happens is, if they're coming down, then over. There's too many intersections right there. wish we had bigger roads, but we don't. See, six lane with a tram. Large road with bus trams. See, that... Six lane roads is the biggest roads we can get. But, it's okay. It's whatever. It's not a big deal. So, I'm going to go ahead and start expanding. Right here. I'm going to come off like this. I'm actually going to uh, curve it a little bit. About right there. Curve it in kind of like that. And we'll go straight with it. Come in kind of like that. do those kind of numbers. Actually, I didn't want to do that. I want to do a smaller road. Like that. Kind 
kind of connect it up like that. Wow, why did I do that? I don't know what I was thinking there, guys. Just connect it up flat like that. I don't want to connect all those roads up at once. I'm not 100% sure on how I'm going to go about connecting them, so I'm just getting the road layout. Make it at least look cool as hell, kind of. Trying to make it look cool. that one a little too close. Okay. I guess we'll kind of do... that I guess we'll do one like that and then one like that now this way I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to handle I'm always going to come up like that and then hit that Okay, I'm going to start piling in more offices now. Piling it on like that. Oh wow, we're getting a lot of abandoned buildings. I will say there wasn't much abandoned down there. There's not any more abandoned there. Got a few abandoned down here. Not too bad. Oh, they're having water problems. Duh, Trent. sewage so we'll have to fix that in just a minute I'm gonna go ahead and at least get the pipes lined out to where
go. Water drainage, we're gonna need one of these other big dudes. Put that like so. Let's go ahead and connect it there. There we go. That helped for a little bit. Wow, things are already becoming even more more stuff's being being abandoned. Let's see what we got. Abandoned. There were no customers. There were no customers. We're losing people. That's that's why. Okay, we needed more offices then. gonna say the why do they not have water oh because it didn't there we go now they got water apparently I missed the connection huh <laughs> are we experiencing a death wave okay Yeah, that area is lacking in death care. What about garbage services? We're okay in garbage. Those areas are not, though, and I'm not 100% sure why. Okay, so. Gotta figure out why we're not able to... Um, got to figure out why our demand of, is re of residential is not climbing. We're actually losing people. Quite a bit of people, actually. This quite concerns me. Offices are coming up. Uh, I'm not 100% sure on what's going on there. Looks like they demand more industrial, so we'll give them that. I wish we could understand. I wish I could understand why we're losing population. That's not helping. We finally went into a plus for like a second. I mean, we still got places we got to fill in over here and everything. I'm not sure if we're getting a big death wave or what's going on. But our demand, nothing is changing. It's like, I want to fill all the rest of this up, but... I'm not sure... What's going on. That'll help those areas out.
But we're losing 220-something people at that rate. Do a small little police station. Put that right there for now. I'll put a police station right here. Also going to put a fire state firehouse right here. Medical. I'm going to put a hospital across the street right there. And that will cover all of that area. Education. How are we looking? University. We're running low on college stuff so it looks like we're gonna need another college somewhere um looks like right there would be a good spot seventy forty percent is highly educated does that mean they're moving over Dun okay yeah Dumptown doesn't they're at least got a high school education Okay. We're still having a big death wave, and I'm not 100% sure on how to resolve it. We're getting some more residential demand, which is good, so I'm going to go ahead and queue that up. Yeah, we're losing people very quickly, and I'm not 100% sure sure why. Garbage. There, people are saying I never knew garbage would pile up so quickly. We are losing landfill capacity. I don't think we're processing it fast enough, but I don't know where we where the weak point is. Unless to get like a some massive, crazy sized uh, incineration plant, fifty nine thousand a week. Large advanced to 136,000 a week. Hmm. But I mean, that's some heavy, heavy ass pollution. I mean, I could set one literally like right there. That's what I'm going to do. I mean, I'm literally going to set it, like, like, right there. Oh, I still can't. <laughs> Go up just a tad bit more and then place it. There we go. Having that incineration plant will help um, with our garbage, hopefully. Uh, how are we looking on garbage production? See that only that barely put us in the safe zone, which is unfreaking real. Um, I'll put a couple of small recycling centers right there. Not quite sure how they're able to produce so much, but sure, whatever. <laughs> Those garbage trucks are heading out to claim all the garbage. Garbage. Like, some of our inner cities are running out of places for garbage, so I'm going to actually add some small recycling centers along the area.
How's death care looking? Put a crematarium right there. Yeah, we've got a big death wave, and I'm not sure how to go about resolving it. Like, our residents are going up in population, or, you know, we're having a demand for residential, but we're losing a hundred-something people a week, and I'm not 100% sure why. Like, we're getting people, but we're on the decline. It's kind of confusing me, you know? Yeah, it's kind of confusing me. So we're now we're getting some more offices built. Just trying to try to figure out why this death wave is not wanting to go the crap away. It's ridiculous. We're gonna hover around sixty thousand till that. I'm assuming we're in a big death wave, and in our luckily our um, wow, holy cow! Talking about chaos there. Okay, whatever. But see, look at that. 208. 224. I don't know why our population is dropping like that. I could only assume it's... Yeah, I could only assume it's like... Hell, I'm going to be honest. I don't know why what's causing it. Because they're saying dead people. Yeah, we've got a big death wave going on right now. Yeah, big death wave. Which is fine. Uh, I would expect that coming in like that. So I, I'm not surprised I am not. Kind of bummed out because our population is still dropping like flies. Yeah, kind of. I mean, at this point, I'm going to build some more industrial over here somewhere. Like, wow, our death wave is... Are we going to finally start hitting the positive? Nope, we hit negative again. We went plus one, plus 39, plus 50. Plus 44. Yeah, it's all over the place. Maybe our death, death wave is finally over. Because, man, that was a nasty death wave we got hit with. Utterly nasty.
don't know why I didn't feel that right there. I don't know why our demands are there, but I, I just can't seem to seal the deal here. Ooh, that helped. Our, our population is hovering around 60,000, 65,000. I cannot figure out how to get past that spot. It's killing me. Okay, our high school... Prowess looks good. Starting to build some more cities, or more high-rise. But we're hovering around that 65,000 mark and can't seem to crack it. Can't seem to crack it. I think it's because our average health has got awful, so... Let's see if we can do something about that. Hmm. Sure, let's add some saunas around the place. If it makes our civilians a little bit healthier, make them live longer, I am not going to complain. So we're just going to pop them everywhere. Look at that, it's already jumped up to 80% health. And my cat's just knocked something over and I don't know what it was. It sounded like glass. I don't know which one of you two did that. You better quit. Tux, I saw you. You better get. There we go. Look at that. See, spamming saunas everywhere helps. That little, that, that little oomph that we need to get over with. Just that oomph. So, we need saunas everywhere. All of them. All the saunas. I've never been to a sauna. Never been. Can't say... Can't say I'm really interested either, being quite honest, so... <laughs> Yeah. Look at that. Our city is growing quite nicely. Nice sunset. Oh, we got a lot of deaths over here, but that's fine. Yep. Yep. Dead people are dying all the time, but our population is increasing by like 300. Our demand is starting to rise big time again. Um, so at that point, I'm just going to go ahead and start expanding our uh, high-density housing. Oh, 
go ahead and expand the offices this way. I'm getting a little bit of a demand for commercial, so I'm going to go ahead and start bouncing it this way as well. But I mean, as you guys can see, we've got a lot of uh, downtown. It's pretty cool. We're slowly, uh, slowly building. Looks like our rise for offices is starting to increase as well. Um, I wish it, like I said, I wish it would tell us the difference between offices and industry. Because to me, that's a big, that's a, there's a big difference. You know? There's a big difference between office and industry. Houses are starting to cl come climb slowly, and we're close to getting that seventy-five thousand. Oh, it's ninety thousand. Yeah, seventy thousand is Metropolis. Ninety thousand is Megapolis. Okay. But as you can see, guys, we're we hit that little death wave. But now I think we've got it. I think we've got it now. I'm actually going to go ahead and increase the demand. Not enough workers. Well, let's go ahead and fix that. Let's come down here and do small, low, low res, low density residents. Dumbtown's already ready to be queued up for some more people. Like our population's increasing quite a bit, and at quite a, quite an alarming rate. I mean, we're not booming or anything, but you know, 200 people a week is pretty good. Pretty good amount of people. Yeah, we're trying to get death waves up here now. How is our death care up here? Well, right there's our crematorium. Actually, our death care is pretty crap. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty crap. Let's do let's do a crypt. It's the most invasive. At least it's the least invasive. And you know, no one, everyone likes living near crypt where there's ghouls and stuff like that. Whoa. We're getting random level ups here. Random rank ups. I like it. I'm actually going to come over here and do some low density um, commercial. Hey, Tux. Hey, bud. Did you knock over the plate? Yeah, you did, didn't you? That look. That big, bald-eyed look gives it away every time. You know better than to be messing with plates. End up getting hurt. Wow, our death care is really, really hurting right now. I don't know how... Oh, wait a minute. No more room? Oh no! So now we're gonna have to transport our dead. We got we gotta while well, that's unloading, we definitely need to put in I'm gonna put a crypt. I'm gonna put a crypt there just because it would be easier. Do we have any other any more like cemeteries? That's a funeral home. Oh, even the cremate and even the cemetery there is full. 
That's why we're having such a big problem with dead people. The dead collector. I'm, I want to use it. Why not? The dead collector. Why not? That's hilarious. I'm going to put one right next to the all the funeral homes and stuff like that. We need to make sure all of our... Wow, we're just getting random rank... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Everything's leveling up. What did I just do? What did I just do? Oh! That made the land value go up humongous. Everything is just ranking up. That's crazy. I'm actually going to put another one up here for giggles, right next to the funeral home. Another dead collector. Why not? We'll give that a little bit of time. Everything is upgrading right now. This is madness. Things are starting to get max level. He is... Tux is literally watching my mouse right now. As I'm playing this game. That is hilarious. It doesn't say how many hearses the dead collector has, does it? It doesn't. Doesn't say how many hearses we have. It just says it collects dead people. The thing is, I don't see another cemetery anywhere. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, the crypts act as cemeteries. That's right. Building is emptying. And they're actually just moving them over to the dead collector. Oh my god, that's savage. Like ten at a time. That is so... Is this all dead bodies? Oh my god. That is so messed up. That's not even funny. It's so messed up. Like, towns are still upgrading. Over the dead people. We're almost at 75,000. Oh my gosh. That's hilarious. I am glad that I got that, that mod. Or that asset. That is hilarious. That has made my day, guys. Legit made my day. Well, made my morning. It is like 2 in the morning because I just got off work. Uh, I work second shift for those who are curious. Um, I do work second shift, so. Yeah, we took a big hike in, in level ups there. No joke. Big, big hike. How are we doing on natural resources? We're only using like, ten, oh, not even 7,500 a week. That's awesome. Hey, boys. No, me and me and I told you. No, no. No mic. No headbutting the mic. I know you want to go sleepy. But go, go sleepy somewhere else. You got your belly full and you took a big gulp of water and now you're sleepy. I know. I know, I know how you feel, big guy. Oh, wow, 450. 381. We are climbing, dude. We are climbing. How are we doing our garbage down here? We should be doing good. I have yet to see the garbage man come after. Uh, garbage man? Where is the garbage man? There's one! Dude! Come get his garbage! Please tell me you're coming to pick up garbage. There's one. Nope, he's going that way. Come on, man. Come pick up the garbage for these guys. Y'all are slacking hard right now. 
These people trying to upgrade, and here you are, not letting us even, not even letting us get, uh, getting that, man. Come on, that's, that's cruel. Yeah, Min Min's really sleepy, guys. No joke. He's over here just, like, grunting. He's so daggone tired. Put a high school right there, because we need some high schools. Uh, I'm going to put this right here. We're actually under capacity for elementary? Wow. Yeah, I don't want to put elementary up here right yet. Actually, yeah, let's put it right next to it. How are we doing on college? Oh, there we go! Now we're a metropolis. Now we got to get another 15,000 people. Another 15,000 people. Somewhere, somehow. Um... How we upgrade the? I'm assuming land value. Oh, more education. Okay, yeah, that's that's fine. That that'll come with time, though. Everything else is good, but education here. Man, Terry Scott, we got like all. See all that out through the under. All that we can't cut all that down. We can't cut it down fast enough. Chill, chill, man, chill. <laughs> Besides, we're replanting them anyways. They replant. Chill out. You're overreacting. Wow, our city, especially down through here, is looking extremely impressive. At this point, guys, we're just kind of filling in. Yeah, we're just kind of filling in. Doing what we need to do. Uh, I think we can buy something now. We can buy a piece of land, which I'm going to buy right here, because that will allow us to move in to that, use that highway. And that's exactly what we are going to do. So I'm going to hit that pause button and destroy all of this. Roads. I just want to. I mean, we could do a turbo roundabout, but I don't want to do that one. There's something else I wanted to do. No, that's definitely not what I wanted to do. Uh, where's that basic one? Three way, a Y interchange. That's definitely not what I want. That's definitely not what I want. Where is that one I got earlier? There's Turbo Roundabout. There's the Cloverleaf intersection. That's the three-way intersection. That's the large Y interchange. Dude, that's that's way too big. That's way too big than what I'm looking for. There it is. That's what I was looking for. Right here. Yep. So we're going to do that like that. I'm actually going to come down with it a little bit. Come with it to about right there. Actually, I'm going to come with it to about right here. Come with it to about right there, and then we're going to come over here to the highways. We're going to do a big curve. Like so.
Okay. We'll curve this as well. Bring it out like so. That's a little too steep. Oh yeah, that looks god-awful, but you know what? It works. And I'm okay with it looking god-awful. So we're going to do this number right here. I don't think there's going to be any kind of traffic coming in and out there, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Wait, I think something's coming up the way. Yep, I'm not seeing any traffic. That sucks. Like, shit. Come on, give us something, guys. Oh, there we go. There we go. We got something coming out. We got we got people coming out of the city. Yep. Let's see here. We're going to do this number now. Is people still is people leaving that city now? Oh yeah, here they come. They're coming in pouring in. Look at that. Okay. We need to figure out how to improve traffic flow there. Oh, that can that, oh. That used to be our old highway. Damn, okay. Um Because right here is our main trouble. Let's go over here in city planning. Let's activate the old town policy. That way, if you ain't supposed to be there, don't go there. Wow. Just wow. We'll have to figure out something on that later. Okay, we'll go ahead and add those. I 
Well, we're getting tra traffic backed up quite a bit there. Um... I wonder if we can reinstate the... Yeah, I want to reinstate the cemeteries. Because why not? How's the average health looking now? 87% on the average health, which is awesome. Really awesome. But I need to figure out... I need to figure out what I'm going to do here, though. Like, traffic is literally backing up everywhere. Old Town Policy, I don't think, is going to help. Yeah, Old Town Policy is not helping there. Um... I mean, traffic's not... Well, the traffic is starting to back up here, but... I'm not sure why. I mean, traffic is moving, but it's backing up. Our traffic is slowly starting to improve now. I'm not sure how or why. But as you can see... This road right here's calmed up quite a bit. This road is now taking the brunt of the city. Which I'm not sure how to fix that. To get more residential demand, so I'm gonna fill up Dumbtown up here. That'll help us with our population some. There we go. That'll help with that. We're getting 500 up per week. Our, I don't think our infrastructure is going to be able to handle this. We need bigger roads. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a gosh darn minute. We can't handle this, so I'm going to pause it. I'm going to upgrade it all. Upgrading all of the roads, guys. Oh, yeah. Big roads for the win. Hoping this will kind of help traffic free flow a little bit.
All right. That should help our traffic flow a little bit. All right, back to it. actually helped the traffic flow a little bit in other areas but I'm not sure how to handle this area like Let's make it a traffic light. I'm pretty sure that won't improve, but... Yeah, I don't think that... There's, we need to redo this somehow. And I don't know how. We might cut it back. Actually, yeah, let's cut it back. Traffic, we'll do highway. I figured it out. Bye. Bye. Yep. Keep the main roads a main road and then let everything else kind of flow itself out, you know? Like, there would be a good place for them to come in. Like that. But that helps decongest this area quite a bit. Uh, wait a minute. I forgot to do an upgrade there. Boom. There we go. That way they can come out. That helped with traffic some. Helped it some. Apparently they can't export fast enough. Well, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. Go ahead and like, subscribe. Share it with friends if you want to see more City Skylines. And I will see you guys on the next part. Later.